Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Macy. Welcome. I'm a second year law student at Northwestern California University School of Law. They're completely online school. And today we're actually in quarantine. So <laughs> we're gonna have a little productive day in quarantine. Um, it's Tuesday. Zach tested positive on Friday. We both just retested again and his like positive line was even darker than his other tests, but I'm still testing negative. So that's good. Hopefully it stays that way. I'm taking today off work. I'm gonna retest again tomorrow. If it's negative tomorrow, tomorrow will be day six, I think. So if it's negative tomorrow, I'll go to work tomorrow. But in the meantime, I wanna get a lot done. The last like couple of days, we've just been kinda hanging out. I've done some stuff here and there, but mostly just resting. And it was actually my birthday two days ago, so we spent my birthday in quarantine as well. Yeah, it's been quite the weekend. I just ate breakfast. I took all my vitamins. I'm following, my mom and I had COVID back in November and her doctor put us on a treatment plan that was like super, vitamin heavy so we've been following that since i'm not testing positive i haven't been taking as much as she had originally said to take but i've been giving it all to zach since he is positive so yeah i just sat down wrote my little to-do list i actually wrote some of it last night i was getting in a super productive mood uh, binge watching all kinds of like productive vlogs to help me get motivated i'm gonna do a lot today so first and what i already did while i was heating up my breakfast was the dishes and then I need to do the laundry. I need to call about our water bill because we have an issue with our billing and I've been calling and nobody will call me back. So I gotta take care of that today. I need to call a roofer to get our new roof scheduled. We have solar panels on our roof. So when we bought our house in December, the seller had paid for a new roof but because we have solar panels we had to find a solar company who would come take them off before the new roof gets done it's been crazy trying to find someone i finally found someone who will do it though so i need to call and get our roof scheduled so i can get the solar guy scheduled as well i need to finish my case briefs specifically for real property but i also want to review all of them for my other classes before i turn them in and then i can turn those in today hopefully um, I need to finish my definitions for business associations. Um, I need to vacuum. I want to reorganize the fridge and kind of like prep some of our produce because we had just gone grocery shopping before Zach tested positive. And then his mom, my mom, and my grandma have all brought us food. So our fridge is completely full. We have like a side-by-side -side fridge, like freezer on one side, fridge on the other. And I hate it. There's no room in it because like... A big bowl of anything just takes up the entire shelf so need to reorganize it so we can get to things a little bit easier and then i have a crochet top someone ordered from me that i want to finish today i finished half of it All right, so I just finished all of my case briefs assignments, reviewed them, now I'm going to submit them. So I thought I would show you guys what it looks like um, because you actually have to submit all of your assignment types for each class together. So here I finished all my case briefs. So I'm submitting all four case briefs, even though they're for different classes, all at one time. Um, so above this, I had to enter like all of my information, my student ID number, my name, my email, blah, 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 blah. And then I can submit them here. Um, I added the files, so I'm going to submit, submitting case briefs assignment, thank you, and then it'll email me, and then once they grade it, I'll get an email that it's been received, and it's just pass or fail. 
So on all of the assignments, except for like your midterm and your final, they are pass or fail. So if you do happen to fail, which I feel like it's gotta be really hard to fail. Like if you just like don't do the full assignment, I think you fail. Um, but if you do happen to fail, you can redo them as long as you like give yourself enough time in between your finals because you have to request to take your finals 30 days in advance. Um, so like you have to schedule it and get that date set up 30 days before. Um, and by the time you do that, you have to have all of your assignments submitted and graded and know that you've passed all the rest of those. So definitely do it sooner rather than later. Um, I'm done with that. I think I'm going to go do some laundry now and watch some TV, eat some lunch. It's 11 o'clock, so I have a lot of time left to get everything else that I want to get done. This is a very real vlog. Um, I look terrible. The circles under my eyes are so bad, but I got knocked on my ass the last three days. After I finished filming those last clips from Tuesday, it's now Saturday, I said I was going to like take a break, do some laundry, eat some lunch. None of that happens because I started getting really bad pain in my hips and like my joints my knees my ankles so i was just kind of relaxing for the night wednesday i woke up felt horrible the joint pain the headache the fatigue i slept pretty much the entire day wednesday i was out of commission um thursday i felt a little bit better so i like took a shower i didn't really do anything other than that i I did try to walk around the house a little bit because my legs had been so like fatigued my muscles and stuff that walking was difficult so I tried to walk around the house a little bit get my legs moving and I think I just overexerted myself because Friday I Friday was yesterday um I was back to not doing so good um I took a couple of naps again yesterday felt terrible I started to get a cough and stuffy nose now which i still have but it is much much better than it was because my nose was so stuffy that i couldn't even inhale like a tiny bit like nothing no air none at all so that was honestly really scary too um it started to give me a little bit of a panic attack so my mom brought me over some nose spray and that helped a lot right now it's going on like 15 hours without using it i used some before bed last night so it's pretty good. It's not, it's, it's not bad. I am not going to uh, overexert myself again today though. I'm just gonna lay in bed, take it easy, and I actually just spent the last almost two hours working on editing this video because I couldn't remember anything that I had filmed from the other day. So I think I'm actually going to take a break to make some food. I need to take my vitamins still and I'm just gonna lay in bed while I eat watch some TV, just take a little break, take it easy. I'll probably take a nap. Um, I had grabbed some of my books and stuff to do some homework in bed, but editing that video took me longer than I had planned it to. So I think I'm just gonna rest for a little while and I will talk to you guys in a couple of hours and maybe we'll move out to the couch, do some laundry or something.